Hello guys and gals, I'm Pal and welcome back to Skyward Sword. Last time we covered hero mode and also a lot of the glitches in the game. And this episode we're going to cover the Silent Realms. This is the second to last episode of all Skyward Sword. Also, I'm very proud of that shot. I did it first, t first try both times, which is impressive, I think. Now, let me go ahead and trigger this one and then we can set out into the Silent Realm challenges. So, <laughs> I got stuck on that cart there. I will be using the Stamina Potion Pluses, plus, not multiple, just plus, in the Silent Realm, because I believe that carries over when you're doing it with Leneru. It doesn't normally, but I believe it does here. I just want to check to, because uh, I want to make sure I know what his rules are. Uh, does he choose consecutive ones? I am not sure. Uh, I quit. I am not sure, but I, I will cut them in order. Yeah, okay. I, I sound a little bit unsure of myself, and that is because I am. But I will be cutting the Silent Realms, because we're going to be doing them all this episode. This is going to be a long episode. So, because of that, I will be cutting the Silent Realms in order from first to last, chronologically. So, yeah, we will start off with the Pharaon and we'll move up. Now, let's go ahead and get started. Stem Potion Plus. Now, I'm drinking this now because I'm not going to be using it when I cover the Lightning Round. So, I'm going to be using this now, and I'm going to be using the Guardian Potion Plus later in the Lightning Round. So, let's go ahead and drink up. And now that we are under the influence of speed, we can go into the Silent Realm without fear. All right, uh, fair on woods. Let's do this. Uh, 4:30. Okay, get this thing started. Let's go. All right, here we are. Now I'm not sure if he will explain. Yes, he will. We're here, Link. Show me what you've got. And that is it. Two, one. Okay, starting off, we will run and. Oh, so stamina does matter. Okay. We'll go ahead and grab this tier right here. Apparently, the potions do not do not uh, carry over, so that's interesting. Let's go ahead and get, go to the top of this so we can see everything. And hopefully mark some stuff with our map or just mentally. Alright, there's one down there, and we're going to go that way. So we're going to be doing this in a counter... Yeah, counterclockwise fashion, just like we did last time. So let me go ahead and avoid this looker and grab the tier. Now, they do refill your stamina, the tears do, so you can depend on that. Go ahead and jump over here, up, 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 over, over, down. Okay, here's a tier, and let's go ahead and jump down here, and go onto the island to get another tier, our fifth tier. Jump, and here we go. There we go, and let's continue on. Let me go ahead and grab this tier over here, and roll through the... Opening? Is this a chaser? I think so, just because he's close to the ground. Although he is a stalker, because he's a moving chaser. So I will avoid him as best I can. And circle around here. Now, c do we have to go down this hole right here? No, we do not. And there is a Dusk Relic here, which I'll go ahead and grab. I, I do want to make sure that it's this comes across as a... A race? No, time trial. Because it is. I'm trying to challenge my time because I want to see how well I can do. I, I can do. Also, I'm trying to. Do, I'm racing you guys as well because while I do not know your times right now, you guys are going to be trying to beat my score, and I don't want that to happen. Just for competitiveness. Now let's see. If I can. No, I can't grab that. Uh, can I jump down from here? I believe I can. Jump. There we go. Made it, and okay, let's continue this way. These are watchers, not chasers, so I can go through here with relative ease. Go in front of this Reaper, jump down, and run down here. And let me go ahead and grab this one. This one ha has waking water with it. Also, there's a Dusk Relic up in that tree, just so you guys know. And let's see. Okay, the water's going away. It is gone. Let me go here and run back, and there we go. There's a chaser right there, so I'll circumvent him. And I see another Dusk rel Relic up on that ledge. So if you want to get it, it's there. I don't personally want to get it, though. Okay, let's go ahead and circle back around. 
We only have three left, and we're hitting the two minute, 30 second mark, so I'm happy about that. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump up here. Once again, I wish that the that the beacon fruits restored at least like half of your stamina, but they don't, which is sad. There we go. Now, there's, there's some over here, I believe. I believe there's one there, but where's the last one? I don't know. Uh. Oh, snap you. Let me go over here. Also, it sounded like I was cursing him because I said snap you, but I was actually like, snap you. I wasn't cursing him. Anyway, let me continue on, and here's the last one. Wow, that was very conveniently placed. Perfect. So, there's my route. Here's all of them, but we still have to get to the beginning. But that is easy because we're right next to the log. That went extremely well. Okay, with... We're not... Uh, let's get back there before three, thir 3 minutes 30 seconds. What, shall we? There. There. Uh, okay. 3.31. That is a good time. I am proud of that. And let's go, I'm going to go and show the text in between, because I would like to know if it's consecutive or not. Way to go, looks like you made it back in one piece. Of course I could, I couldn't die. Yes, I know that. Take this as my prize, 50 rupees, 100 rupees. Oh, okay, so if you break your record when doing the Silent Realms, it gives you 100 rupees. Beat the record, ooh. Oh, a challenge. I didn't know that. Okay. Uh, so in the video description, I will explain how the, you know, no, let me just cut. Just a second. New record. Yep, I know. 50 rupees. Okay, 50 rupees for breaking the record, apparently. Uh, yeah, let's do that. But I'm going to cut so I can explain what this is, how it, oh, we can pick. Okay, just a second. I'm going to explain how this thing is laid out as soon as I find out for myself, because I do not know. I went into this not knowing. I was thinking it was identical to lightning round, but apparently it isn't. Just let me cut. Just a second. Alright, I have confirmed how this works. How it works is that there are four prizes, and I actually will, will not... Yeah, I will. There are four prizes that he will give. And he gives those based on the times of every Silent Realm, of every time you do the Silent Realm. So, if you get the worst time, so if you get, like, more than 4 minutes and 45 seconds on uh, the Fair on Wood Silent Realm, for example, you'll get 5 rupees. The, se the next prize is 20 rupees, which is 3rd place. 2nd place, which I got just now, is 100 rupees, and 1st place... He always gives you a blue bird feather, or golden skull, or a golden, or a goddess plume. And that is the first place prize if you get less than a certain amount of time on each of the Silent Realms. So, that's really neat. Now, I will be putting exactly what the times are and the prizes are in the video description, so you guys can scroll down there while watching this video, and you guys can see what you can get. It's really neat that you don't get rewarded for consecutive things, you get rewarded four times, which I like that better. Alright, let's go ahead and go ahead and enter the Elden Volcano. Best time, good. Let's get this started. And let's show him what we've got. Let's see, uh, we can go up this path here, because that will take less time. So let's go that way. If you guys remember, normally what I would do is I would lure the guardians around and trick them and grab the one that they're right next to however this is the one that i believe the designers wanted you to get because you can just jump over here jump over here and get it now where i'm going to go from here is i'm going to go up and around here we are and i'm going to get this corner first okay let me look up here uh i remember that i can stand on the corner right here or not. Oh, snap. Alright, if that's how you want to do it, I will gladly do that. Uh, let me try and get through this with my life. Up, run. Oh, snap. Well, <sighs> failure number one, I guess. I think that's, yeah, that was the first time I failed the Silent Realm in the LP. Wonderful. 
Oh, you really fumbled that one, my friend. And failure comes with a price. You've left with a single heart. Go, better go grab some more. Wow. One heart. All right. Well, I'll cut back to that. Be right back. All right. I'm back where I left off. Now, what I my mistake was is that normally I run around here and run down here and then go back up. And I did not do that. So let me refill my stamina, then let me run up and jump up here, right here, and just chill right here. There we go, because I know I'm safe right there. And let me go ahead, and once he turns around, I'll run up. And that's how you do it. Okay, that was my mistake. Now let's go ahead and go up and grab this, and then we can slide back down. Hopefully avoiding those guys. Now I'm not going to stop for the Dusk Relic. Because that is for children. There we go. Let me go down here. I'm not insinuating that if you get that, you're a child. I'm just saying... I don't know what I'm saying. Forget what I said. And hopefully I avoid the glitch that I got caught in last time. Because that'd stink. Being stuck in a glitch in a time trial, no less. Oh. Snap. Okay. Let me go. There we go. Got this. And turn around. And let's go this way. And let's go ahead and take a left. Go this way. I think this is the best way. Because then you can just go on down from there. So I'm going to do it this way. Okay, now that I'm here, let me go ahead and run into the lava room. There's one up there, so I'll go get that. Once again, I really wish that Beacon Fruits refilled your stamina somewhat. Even in just a tiny bit. It'd be nice. Okay, let me go ahead and slide down here. And take it left. Jump. Go down here. And there's one over there. Okay, so I want to jump down here. And go to the left. There we go. Here we are. And jump. Jump. And here we are. Now I will jump down and run up. Oh, snap. Oh, okay. Uh, hopefully I can run from here. Please be able to run. Okay, I am. Neat. Nice. Okay, let me go ahead and run all the way up around here so I have time to avoid the... There we go. That's what I want to do. And... Whoa, turn. And let's continue on. There we go. Take a left and take a hard right. Take a left. And jump down. Very nice. Now there is one tier right here. I'll go ahead and grab that. Turn around and let's continue on. Now we just have to go down these vines, and then we will be able to get this one right here. Go down, refill our stamina, come up, refill our stamina again. Uh, I want to hop down here. Please don't hop on the lava. Good. And let's run across this alley. This I always think of these as a bowling alley, because that one part in the game where you have to actually bowl. Did I go the wrong way? No, I did not. Good. Uh, I'll leave that one for later. Let me jump down here. Snap! No! No! Okay. Wonderful. That, that was hasty of me. I should not have done that. Okay, he's going to turn around. I could have probably made it by then. Let me jump down here. Good thing is you don't get too bad of a penalty for falling in lava, so... Alright, here is the platform. Let me jump. Jump on the bone. Grab the tier, turn around, jump back on the platforms. And there we go. We have almost all of them. And I have very good time right now. Alright, here we are right here. We just have to swing on the rope and then swing backwards. Hopefully I can line this up so I don't have to be on there for like 20 seconds. Can I line it up? No, actually I can't. Okay. So let me go backwards. And swing. There we go. Nope. Swing. There we go. And there we go jump and here we are let's continue on and i don't know where the rest of them are uh there's one right here okay now i know where they all are there's one here grab that jump down here grab this one over to the left and then go through the glitchy area hopefully not glitching the game again i'm going to tempt life here by doing a roll okay we're good and now that we're through here we can just go on this rope run up the rope, which is probably incredibly foolish, though I need uh, as much time as I can get. Okay, here we are. 
Grab the tier and jump down without falling in the lava. That was close. There we go, and let's go ahead and run through here, and we just have to make it back. And we can grab the last tier along the way. And it's just along this path right here. Just jump, and jump, and yet actually we have to go back around here, which is inconvenient. I don't think I'm going to be getting the first place time, though I'll probably get second place, because I'm doing fairly well. Uh, jump down this way, and he's going to pass by. Let me run. And... There you go, there's the last one up there. Right, right, cheer. Very good. And now we just need to head back, which we're very close to, to the beginning anyway, so that's nice. And it will light a beacon, which we don't need, because we know our way around here. By now, we should have our way about to this place. There we go, run, run, run. Run! Oh, that was close. I almost bit the lava there. I like spicy food, but I do not like eating lava. You can quote me on that one. Because I'm pretty sure that applies to everyone. Except, I don't know, uh, Pyron? I don't know. And finish! 5.55.66. Very good. Um, about half my original time. Very good. More than half. And... 555.66. And, oh, I got the first place time. Three, two, one, go. All right, there, we're in the Laneru Silent Realm, which is arguably my favorite, because yellow is probably one of my favorite, most favorite colors of all time. I really love yellow. Like, it's, I love lemon yellow. Yellow Pikmin are my favorite. I don't think I... I didn't mention that in the uh, Pikmin LP, but they are. Okay. Uh, let's go this way. Now, I'll, I'll admit, I'll be the first one to admit that I do not know this Silent Realm as much as well as I do others. So, I probably won't be getting first place time on this. But I will be trying my best to always know where I'm going. Or, no, not always know where I'm going, but always be going somewhere. I may not know the correct path, though I will know that I'm going to one tier. So that's that's good. I, d I have done this many times. I just am not familiar with it. Okay, let me, let me climb up here. This guy is a watcher, not a looker. Or chaser, sorry. He's a looker, not a chaser. That's, that's how it is. Now let's jump down here. Jump up this way. And grab this tier right here. I want to head all the way around. I'd really like to get a beacon fruit. Are there any up here? I do not see any. Uh, let's go this way, because I know there are beacon fruits over there. Grab this. Go over here. Jump. Run over here. Leave that. Uh, leave... Uh, 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 leave this tier for later. However... Oh, we're going to go get this tier first. Okay. Because this is arguably one of the most time-consuming ones. Well, not really the most time-consuming, but the most... Yeah, it is the most time-consuming, because it uses some of the most stamina. Okay, let me grab that, jump over here, and jump over here. Let me go around up this way, because this is the way I always go. Uh, go up top. Can they chase me when I'm up here? No, they can't. Good. That, that's actually very, very good. Alright. Actually, yeah, okay. I was just planning some stuff in my head. What I'm going to do is I'm not going to care if they see me when I go up here, because I'm just going to grab the tier. So, yeah, hit me if you want. Make throw fit and that is fine. Here we go. Let me just grab this tier and it's as if they never saw me. Now I can jump down this way. Oh my whoa. Actually. Wait, is that a thing? Whoa no! Ugh. Okay, do they see better uh, in the direction that they're looking? Because that just makes sense, and I'm kind of surprised I didn't realize that. Actually, yeah, I think they do. Oh my word, they do. Wow. Cold ice in the fridge. They do. Okay, I did not know that. They actually have a, a legit line of sight. I did not know that. That makes perfect sense now that I think about that. Alright. That's... You learn things every day. Most of you do. I... No, never mind, I won't go into that. Let me grab this tier and... 
There's one up top of this, which I'll get last, I think. Just because it's in the center, and I don't know, don't know where I'm going to end up, so I'll just leave the one in the center for last. Okay, let me go get this one. This one is unguarded, surprisingly. Uh, are there any over there? I could really use a beacon. Oh, wait, I have a beacon fruit. So where are the last ones? There's one there. Uh, oh, there's some over here. Oh, okay. Well, let me go get those. And hurry up while doing it. So are these, there are these two, then there's one behind me, and then there's one on the top. Okay, so I know where all of them are. That's good. Okay, uh, as soon as this goes away, I will pull this. There we go. Pull, pull, pull. And it's coming back, but I am out of the way. There we go. Uh, there we go. Can I please jump on it? Thank you. Good. Now let me go ahead and grab this one. Now, actually, I, I said that I didn't know this one very well, but actually... This one, I think I've done the best on. I'm the most proud of it. It's very good. All right, let's go ahead and go get that one near where all those lookers are, and then we'll finish this Silent Realm out with the top of the tower. Okay, there's this guy. Please turn around, turn around, turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Thank you. Man, you go far. You just keep going and going and going. Actually, can I... Oh, please say yes. Let me drop. No! Oh, I was really hoping that would work. Okay, well... Uh, yes! Okay, well that worked. I should have just tanked through them to begin with. Ugh. Oh, gross, man. Okay, I don't think I'm getting first prize, though. I think I'll get second. Of course, I said that last time. Okay, let me jump up here. There are vines around this side. Uh, the vines are here, here, here they are. Hello, vines. Let me climb up this way, and the vines are up to the left. I can see them right here. Turn, 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 stem fruit. Climb up, and then I can jump down the rest of the way once I get this last tier. Hello. There we are. Yellow tier of Nehru. Which, actually, they should be blue, but I won't argue, because I like yellow the best. Yellow, well... My favorite colors are probably, like, whitish blue, and then, so it'd be whitish blue, then it would be white, no, whitish blue, blue, and then yellow, I think, are my favorite colors. I also like lime green, but, eh, it's not my most favorite color. And 545.26, that's a good time, it's much better than my first, my original time. All right, let's go ahead and start this off. Skyloft, the final Silent Realm location. Let's start it off with a bang. Okay, let me grab that, and let me go in a uh, clockwise, yeah, clockwise fashion. I think that'll work the best. Okay, he's going to turn around. Let me go ahead and run through here. I want to get first prize on this just because it would show off my skill. All right, there's one right here. Let me grab that and turn around, and let's go this way. There is a Dusk Relic behind that bench, but I don't care about it. Um, there are none here. There aren't any down there, I remember for a fact. Because that I, I went down there once, and it was like, no, actually, you are dead wrong. We will not reward your exploration. Alright, so let me climb up this way. And I will climb up the side of the building first, then I'll jump down. I think that'll work the best. So let me climb around here. Jump, and jump, and drop. Now, it looks like we're actually not doing very well because I've reached a minute, and I only have one or three tiers. But actually, a lot of the tiers are clustered together, so that time is actually a little bit wrong. Okay, let me run, and turn around, and pull this. There we go. And we're out of his, his sight now, so now I can jump up on the box. And grab that, and let's go this way. There's a tier right here. And here's what I mean about tiers being close together. There's one right here, but there's also one over here. And there's one if we backtrack a little bit. We just jump down this way. No chasers. Good, there are no chasers. 
So we can grab this and go around here and grab that other one. If we hurry, we can get onto the rafters right here without falling to our deaths. Good. There we go. And wait for him to pass. Ah, snap. He, we're going to have to wait a long time. You know what? I'm just going to go around here because I think that's quicker. Hopefully it's quicker and I didn't just waste time, but I think it is. All right. Let me run up this way. No stamina fruit, sadly. They should have placed them a little bit better. Okay. Ah, snap. I didn't mean to do that. Now, I, uh, now I'm kind of feeling the pressure, because last, last time I found out that I got third place, and that's bad. That's just bad. I want to get first on this one. All right, so we can just jump over here, grab this, and I'll run across the water. Now that I have a stamina fruit, I can see where I'm going, so it is... Uh, this way... Is there one over there? No, there isn't. So let me jump on this, and I will run across. Hopefully this is a wise move. I'm really hoping. Uh, there's one on the bridge, so yeah, I think this is a wise move. Uh, there's one chasing me. It's right behind me. Okay, here we go. Good. Very good move. That actually worked out extremely well. Alright, so we want to go through this way. We don't want to go near the waking water right now. We're just going to go down here, jump. And now we can deal with the waking water as it recedes. There we go. And now let's go to the graveyard because there's one in there. Uh, go up up these stairs. Up to the top of this building. And jump down here. And here's one. And we have two left. And I know where they are. Good. That's extremely good. Okay, let me run here. There we go. And the next one and the second to last one is in the pumpkin patch. This one's not that hard, and actually, no, I won't do that. I was going to say, I can run for the last one, but no, that's that's not how I'm going to do that. All right, let me restore some stamina, and this next pass, I should be able to get it. Here we go. There we go, and let's go grab the last one. Um, there we go, just bypass him on the railing, and let's go to the last one. That is on top of the tower, which is probably not the most ideal place to get the last one because it's so inconveniently placed you know you have to climb up for a long time so eh, this one's going to make or break your time really okay let me jump up here this guy is not a chaser thank goodness no he is he's a chaser no how could he be a chaser why would the designers do that ever okay actually you know what I can just go up here because even if he finds me I can just do this all right good I did not know that he was a stalker. Yeah, he's a stalker, not chaser, because he's a moving chaser. That's horrible. He he just got some respect in my book. Okay, let me jump down here. And it doesn't matter if he chases me, because I could have actually jumped in the end. But instead, I'll get a time of 434.33. Very good. Way to go, Link. Looks like it made it back in one piece. The time it took you to finish this trial was 4.34.33. Very impressive time. Here, this is your prize. 100 rupees. So I got second place, that's good. But his time is 4 minutes. Okay, I think I can do that. But I'm not going to do it because this episode is over. Thank you so much for watching. Wait, no, I just did them all. Be quiet. <laughs> Boring. Thank you guys so much for watching. And that is the, it for this episode. Next episode is the final episode of all of Skyward Sword, of my entire LP. And it's actually a very fitting episode, because in that, we will be taking on every single boss in Skyward Sword in chronological order. And so you guys can see my times on them, so you guys can try and beat them. Well, I'm probably not going to be beating my time in the Gur first Gurahim battle, you know, 856, or 956. But I'll, I will try. And I'll get the best times I, that I can. And I will be using, I will be showing off what a Guardian Potion Plus does at the end of the episode. Though I'm not going to be using it while I'm battling the bosses. So I, I still want this to be a challenge for me, as well as a challenge for you, because you guys get to see. Whoa, hearts! Because you guys then get to see, you know, if you guys can beat my time, so you can see how good you are compared to me. Probably very, very good. I don't really think I'm an expert anyway. I'm I'm rambling at this point, so I'm just going to go ahead and end it here. Thank you so much for watching, 
and I'll see you guys next time on Skyward Sword. Oh, by the way, I release Skyward Sword Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. And I'll see you guys next episode, which I believe is Saturday, for the true finale. Bye.